I think that there's three key steps. I was just talking to Karen. The three key steps to becoming a social enterprise. Number one is, what about your database? What about your customer data? Are you paying attention to your customers? Do you know their social handles? Are you capturing their tweets? You know, we've seen some really interesting examples of customers like Bank of America, or like KLM, where you'll see them on Twitter. Those are actually now, their call centers and contact centers are deeply integrated in the social networks. They're capturing your information on the social networks to become part of your customer record. The step one is looking at the customer database itself. You know, I had this really interesting and exciting experience where I showed up at a conference that I was doing, and I was tweeting on a plan, hey, I'm going to this conference in Boston, it's very exciting, I can't wait to get there. You know, we're doing this big thing, oh, I love this restaurant at this hotel, it's amazing, I can't wait to get to this restaurant, and I want to go to this show in Boston, it's incredible. Anyway, I get off the plane, I get to the hotel, I walk into the hotel, they go, Mr. Benioff, we are so glad you are here. Fantastic to have you. We know this is your favorite hotel. You can put your room just like you want it together. That restaurant you want, we got your table. The best table, we got it for you. And the tickets you were talking about for the theater done, it's on your nightstand, ready for you. No, that did not happen. <laughs> you know that did not happen. You know what happened. It's what happened to you last night when you got to off to Texas. Here's your keys. <laughs> Do you know how much hotel space I buy all over the world? I won't tell you what hotel it was. It's embarrassing for them, it's embarrassing for me that I can't get to them to say, hey, you need to transform, you need to change, you need to advance, you need to go forward, now is your time. This is an incredible opportunity. These opportunities come off so rarely. Now you can take advantage of that opportunity. So step two is, how do you bring all your employees on board? You've heard about chatter. How do you get your employees Connected to you. Is email the answer? I don't think so. How do you connect your salespeople, your service people, your custom applications? You need to build this next generation of apps, this employee social network. And then the third step, which is amazing, is a customer social network and a product social network. And how do you bring your customers into the network? The idea storm, that was visionary. <coughs> That was the idea of how do we build a customer social network? How do we bring our customers in? In the new version of Chatter, you can create a group and create IDs to bring your customer right into the groups inside Chatter. How do you do that? How do you do that? And then the next key piece is products. We were just talking about Karen. You know, we're building this new car with Toyota. It's called the Toyota Friend. Because I have a Chevy Volt, okay, which is an amazing car. It, it's probably the most advanced car right now that's available in the world today. It's a way to put a drop of gas in this car. It's a phenomenal car. But you need to know more about this next generation of car. You need to have a relationship with your car in a way that you didn't before because it's not always available ready to go. You know, I want to collaborate with my car. I want my car to be my friend on my social number. Hey, I'm charged up. Let's go. Oh, the tire is low. Service station around the corner. Hey, your wife is actually in the car two blocks away. Do you want to go over there? Maybe not. <laughs> Customer social networks, product social networks, and built on the cloud, on fast, on easy, on open, on everyone. Let me ask you a question. How many people here work in companies that have more than 1,000 employees? Raise your hands. Not just small and big, everybody. Fast to get going and easy. It's, it's the cloud. That's the power. But, you know, I was at that show last week at Oracle, and they said their vision of the future of the cloud, the cloud is a box and it's proprietary. It has a big X on it. And the proprietary mainframes are the future. But haven't we seen that movie already? Our proprietary mainframes, the future, it didn't really work out very well for some. That was also their message. Or is it the message that we have at this conference of open and affordable? And standards based. And that's really the three steps to create your social enterprise.